second half. And again, more meat. My, one of my sponsors is Moo and Oink, the biggest Chicago <laughs> rib, chicken, french fry, everything. Oh, I'm coming. Tell them you're coming. Oh, I'm coming to eat some ribs and some chicken. Me, him, and my brother. It's we over. Put y'all out of here, dog. Mad Kyle ain't got nothing. Oh, what are we going to do? Hey, man, DJ Fink, Club and TV, Deroy. Yo, what's, what's going, going on, on, boy? What's happening, man? Hey, you've been in everything, so I asked your brother some of the movies. Tell everybody what you've been in. I've uh, been in Me, Myself, and Irene. Oh, my God. Old school. Oh, my God. We cook out together. Oh, fun. How to be a player. Woolworth, like you said. Alicia, Alpha Maddie, the news. Oh, the new guy. Oh, the new guy. And it's good to see a brother with your stature. Yeah. <clears throat> What'd you say about Todd? Hollywood. Oh, you. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you sitting here working. I got work to do. Okay, I can play. Man, I can play anybody skinny. Just get me from the side. Anyway, check it out. We're here to talk about the movie. I talked a little bit with the brother. Tell me how, how you felt, you know, filming with, in a real jail, you know, in a real correctional facility with the jail. Brother, you know right. what I'm saying? They was like, oh, two dudes from movies or whatever. You know, fat boys from movies. You know how to do the same. They have an influence. And, um, man, they just gave us all love, man. We really, you know, they didn't have no problems with filming with any kids or anything like that, man. And everything just, you know, like, you know, real smooth for man. While we were off, we were talking about you and your brother doing uh, various movies, and yeah. you know, you said you flipped the coin and the side yeah. between old school. Yeah. How much competition is that between you and your brother? Um, actually, I don't really look at him as competition because I'm better than him. Oh, so no, nah. <laughs> it's not like that. It's like, um, you know, when we go out different for the same part, you know what I'm saying? Before we even leave the house, we go go. Hope one of us get it. You know, right? Straight up. You know, it's still money for the family. It's going to be money for right. either one of us right. anyway. So it don't matter because we share just about everything. We get it, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm scared to ask about women, but go ahead. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Skip day. Actually, we both were in it. Okay. I was in it, and he did a cameo in it. All right. That's another another thing. We went out for the same part. They flipped the coin. And just thought, well, we're right, gonna put both of them in there. Right. And um, got that coming out. Senior Skip day. Um, trying to get a production deal right now. We writing it. And, you know, I'm trying to get into you know behind the cameras and everything right now. Okay. Well, look, you got thousands of fans, millions of fans looking up to you and your brother. If you have an opportunity right now to talk to somebody who's having a hard time, a you. You know, maybe going down the road that they shouldn't be on. What would you tell them? I just tell them for real, man. Just look at us, man, because I'm from LA. You know what I'm saying? We're from South Central. You know what I'm saying? We grew up right. like the South Central and White. Right. You know what I'm saying? Not even Avalon. Right. You know what I'm saying? So we're from the hood. So I seen, you know what I'm saying? People get shot. You know what I'm saying? People get killed. You know what I'm saying? All this and that and drug deal. But I had really good, you know, my parents kept us so grounded. Right. You know what I'm saying? They used to tell us we couldn't even go in the front yard sometimes. Wow. You know what I'm saying? I'm for real, for real joke. Everybody know my mom, my mom and dad out there. They know my parents. They know they know they don't play. And um, man, we just stay at it, man. And luckily everything started taking off for me and my brother, man. You know what I'm saying? Because we could have went in another situation. You know what I'm saying? Another different situation. I got some boys that's locked up. You know what I'm saying? Who I grew up with. You know what I'm saying? I lost friends that I didn't grow up with. You know what I'm saying? And it's the same people that, you know, I was, you know what I'm saying? I was running with them, you know what I'm right. saying? Like, they're my boys still to this day, you know what I'm saying? I still see them and they still my boys. Right. But you know what I'm saying? They see us and they're like, man, we proud of y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? Man, that's feel good, good man. It? You know what I'm saying? Y'all came above that, man. And, you know, just just try to keep a good head about everything, man. Just try not to get washed up in that BS, man. And, you know, 
I know it seems that your parents, you need to go home and hug them tonight because they raised two yeah. fine gentlemen. I wish you guys continued success in everything you do. <laughs> 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 go out and see the 